What's up guys, TechPonky here and in this video I'm going to show you how to downgrade iOS 8.4 beta back to iOS 8.3 So let's get started So after a while using iOS 8.4 beta 1 I noticed that it has many issues and many bugs on it So in this video I'm going to show you how to downgrade it So the first thing you need to do is to plug in your Apple device to your computer then go ahead and launch iTunes and iTunes will detect your Apple device here so click on that and here I need to talk about that so if you have already done a backup on iOS 8.3 don't do a backup right now because actually uh, it does need it because if you do a backup now and then go back to iOS 8.3 uh, you won't be able to restore it restore your Apple device with uh, this backup that you did just now because Apple does let to restore a newer iOS version backup to another one so I don't know what it, why Apple has done it but anyway it's this way so don't do it if you already have but if you have if you don't have it if you don't have than a uh, backup on iOS 8.3 uh, just do a backup now because when iOS 8.4 the original not beta released so you can uh, restore it with uh, the beta the backup of the uh, beta so after that go ahead and launch your web browser and go on this website here this one uh, the link is in the description as always and here you need to select your Apple device, have an iPad mini and my case and here you need to select your iOS version that you need to downgrade with uh, it's iOS 8.3 as you can see here sign it, that means you can restore with iTunes but it won't be forever in a few days or a few weeks Apple will stop the signing and it will be uh, blocked and you will not be able to downgrade so this is for a limited time, not forever. So after you have the uh, you have downloaded the firmware, uh, go on your Apple device. So here on your Apple device, you need to enter it to the DFQ mode. So to enter it, uh, keep holding the uh, home button, the power button, and the home button at the same time for 10 seconds. So let's get to it. One, two, three, go. One, two, three. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, release the power button, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, leave it, and now iTunes should appear a message, so let's get to my computer, so here as you can see iTunes has a message here, the iPad is in recovery mode, but actually is in the FU mode, not in the recovery. Uh, hit OK, and then here's a big step. Uh, on Mac, keep holding Alt and press uh, the Restore iPad button. But if you have Windows, keep pressing on Control and press on the Restore iPad. So I have Mac, so I'm gonna keep holding the Alt button, and here. Uh, I'm going to drag it into here, so this is the framework that I need to restore with, so I'm going to keep pulling all again, and I'm going to drag it into here. So, after that, you hit the open button, and it will ask you to restore. Hit yes, and after the, the process has been finished, after the restore has been finished, uh, you should you need to uh, complete the activation of on your iPad the activation mode and after you're done you're clear and you're back to iOS 8.3 so that was the video for today guys I hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe to my channel to watch my latest videos and tutorials and also follow me on Twitter and like my Facebook fan, fan page to watch my latest activity thanks, thanks for watching and I'm gonna see you next time